Hey guys, welcome back to Listen to Apples. So, today we are going to do another Halloween makeup tutorial. So, as you can probably tell by my cat ears, we're going to make a pretty fun cat. First off, you can use any colors that you'd like with this look, but I am going to stick to brown, blue, and like a purpley color. Um, I think it'd be really pretty in white, it'd probably be really pretty in all black, it'd be pretty in all brown. Um, you could also think of this as like a tiger, I guess. Um, but let's just jump right into it. Uh, I have one foundation and I have one mascara and my eyebrows are also done. Um, yeah, so get into that. <laughs> let's just jump right in. So first I'm going to lay down a cream base and watch. I'll do like a, a voiceover over this whole thing because I'm going to talk through it, but I'll probably do a voiceover over the whole thing. But first I'm going to lay down a cream base. I'm going to take um, a Sephora cream eyeshadow and I'm going to do it over my, I'm going to kind of pat it up here. You can kind of take it into your eyebrow. You know the thickest part to be like over top of your brow. That's actually a really pretty color. Because if I wasn't going to be a cat. You can drag it down there because that's just, it's just pretty. It's just, it's just pretty. So now, I'm going to do the same thing on the other eye. Actually, I'm going to do one eye first and then I'll probably do the other eye camera until I get it to like where I want it to be. I'm super excited about Halloween and I want to be like super festive when we go to work. I think the kids get like a super cool kick out of it. first. So also cream shadows from Sephora. And then just blue cream shadows. <sighs> Ugh, I'm scared. Oh yeah, this is like scary. And so that I'm keeping with the fun theme of cream shadows, I'm actually going to take a brown, which is super dark. I'm just going to kind of throw it onto my lid. Just so that there is something on my lid and not just a bareness. I'm going to have a hand in there. There's a towel over there and just wipe down the wall over here but I'm just keeping with the fun of the angled brush just a nice little pad set this with them. Okay, so now we're gonna move on to the rest of the face. I'm gonna move on to underneath my oh stop chin and this is more of a like fun funky fun funky like tiger kind of look and I'm gonna just highlight every place that I get a pimple right now. Oops. 
Yeah, it's all cool. As Paula is uh, breaking out, putting all this stuff on my chin, and I'm just also going to take it off. I have a glitter mustache. Let's get with it. I'm just going to take it around. I want to have a beard, right? Let's just take it around town. Take it around town now. Going in with a brown, green one that I use to make it not look like, you know, I'm just a silver sparkly bowl. Let's just endure this out. So. Sorry, I should have little whiskers. You mentioned that Pete the Cat is Navy. Why am I going all the way down there? What am I doing with my life? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing with my life. Okay, I don't like it all the way down there, so we're just gonna pat it off into the color. Just pat it off into the color. And I kinda wanna keep it up, actually. Oh my god, I ate like a weird swordfish. This is cricket. Okay, so here it is with the bottom of it wiped off. I like it like 10 times better. Um, this is probably how, or, how I will wear it to work. I probably actually will not do the black and do like a red look instead. Um, but that's just because I really like red look. I had so much fun filming this. was a lot of... Uh, fun, it was a lot of fun drawing the lines, and literally it just took an angle brush and some lines. You can literally do it in any color. Um, 
I actually might try to do it in white. Maybe all black would be really pretty. Um, but yeah, look at that. I just thought, I just turned my bottom look black. Look at that. Huh. Um, don't do that when you're trying to do that. That's why I said I was going to wear red lip. It's just transferred, so I would do the whole lip red and just get it over with. But it was the fun, and I would probably just outline the top of it. Actually, let's try that. Mm -hmm. like, we'll try that before we I'm just gonna lie with a red. See you guys. Yeah, I'm just gonna. Hey, hey, hey. You need to do those for a little bit, you know what I'm trying. It's actually about the color that I would use. Where is it? No, no, no. It's like a dark, very dark baby purple. Lipstick all nasty. Hmm. Well, there it is with a red lip or a redder lip. You could definitely add. Let's add some lip gloss. You just have them with it. So this is a um, pretty much matte. I like it, it's fine, whatever. You know, so let's just add some holographic lip gloss to it. You can see. I forgot how much I love fall. And how much I love fall lipstick. Mm. Actually, I, I, I love it this way. This I've, I've met it. Yeah, this is it for me. <sighs> Yay! Finally, finished the cat. This is my final look. I love it like this. This is awesome to me. Um, if you're wondering where I got my ears, I got my ears from Target for a dollar. Cheapest cat ears ever. Actually, probably not. But I would totally wear this headband like everywhere. So I can. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you got a little bit of inspiration. Once again, this is Pete the Cat inspired, so you definitely do not have to use blue tone, anything. Um, try it with white, try it with black. And if you do try it out, um, tag me on Instagram at Let's Be Pineapples. One, that will also be linked down below. Um, tag me on Facebook at Let's Be Pineapples. Tag me everywhere, because I want to see it. So I um, hope you guys have a happy Halloween and a wonderful week. I love you.